Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld. Yep, we got Rabbit and Cather who had a, a brawl at the end of the last episode. I made them sit down and eat together, and they're, they're going to have to learn how to get along. Anyway, they're both going to take off over to the hospital over here where Yolanda is is sleeping, trying to get over the the uh, last of her injuries from that battle she uh, she joined us really quick it's a couple of visits and she said you betcha so how about we give Yolanda a new name Yolanda is now gonna be known as Sea Stars so Sea Stars welcome and with that I've only got one more female on the list and even that one was really Manuel was willing to become Manuela in order to get into the game in the next 80 episodes or so. But if there are any other uh, female subscribers that would like to join, let me know and I'll get you on the list. Because it's it's amazing, this, this series, almost every prisoner has come through here has been female. That's just... It's frustrating because there's so many guys that want to be in the series and there aren't any guys showing up. The last four were all women. So, yep, that's just the way it rolls. Okay, um, let's go here before I forget character. Who is Sea Stars? Sea Stars was a cave world tunneler as a child. Worked as a digger in the massive underground cave complex. She knows rock so well that she can almost navigate caves by smell. Shooting negative two, construction plus one, and mining plus six. Wow. And a medieval doctor as an adult. Worked as a doctor on a medieval planet, she firmly believes that most ailments can be cured with a little bloodletting. <laughs> um, she was also a master anesthetist? Hmm. I'm thinking more anesthesiologist. I guess anesthetist. Developing a specialty technique that involved a heavy blow to the head. <laughs> Okay, we got our backup doctor here. Melee plus six. She knows how to use a club. And medicine plus one. Okay. Um, Night Owl. So on the crew with Missipi and Natalia. Uh, fast learner. Has a knack for learning. She picks things up much faster than others. Global learning factor of plus 75%. Wow. And lazy. Is a little bit lazy. Global work speed negative 20. Okay. So, mining, that's the main, backup of medicine, and is part, part of our potential melee brute squad that's going to live in this area that gets the, uh, you know, the, the red alert klaxon going off whenever these guys decide to, uh, to do a jailbreak. Just right up the hallway and thump, thump, thump. That's the plan. All right, so we're set up with... Sea stars on schedule, yeah. So one on mining and one on hauling, since most others that are doing hauling or cleaning are doing cleaning. So I've got Alicia as a potential hauler as well. Um, otherwise, I think we're good. Restrict um, right there. Got her on a night owl schedule and assign. She's melee right there, and yep, I think we're good. Okay, so what is next? What is going on here? Still raining. It's been raining forever. And food is getting a little precarious here because it is 104 degrees outside. Inside the freezer we're at 51 degrees. Fully healed. Good. Sea Stars is fully healed. Which means meals are going to go bad in three days. Meat in one day. Yeah, Shantigo, let's just keep filling this up. This meat is... I see, you're, you're right there, you're going after veggies. Okay, this meat is venison. That is boomalope. That is boomalope. Okay, so, um, Shantigo, you're trying to get to there. There's 38 of this. Go ahead and can I get you just to haul? No empty space. So there's a dog already on its way to right there, maybe divot. Someone's going to haul some veggies over. Don't know who. Uh, minor break risk of Eric. What's up with Eric? Eric, you are down here in the dark. Needs, you need a rest. Oh, I've got you doing something and, and locked you in, in there. So let's do a quick roll call. Who's doing what right now? Make sure that nobody's going to uh, go crashing on us. Tending to Rabbit. Okay, Tomislav's going to deal with, uh, with these two. So Rabbit and Natalia is sleeping. So when you're done with Rabbit, just move on over and, 
and do Catherine next. So we've got both of you there. Okay. Um, so that's Tomislav Handy. You, I sent you out here to to redo these five traps over here. Actually, six, seven. So this group right in here. Um, you're needing to sleep sooner though, like right now. So we're gonna make you do those five, and then you can you can head in because you've got such a a big uh, cushion on the mood here. Klaus has got more rest so he can go a little longer so I gave him the rest of them we'll see if that works out okay Shantigo um well rabbit we know where he is he he got beat up <laughs> Shantigo is cooking away trying to salvage the meat probably not the best time to have uh, gone on a hunt that's for sure you know the meats would it would have lasted longer walking around on four legs out there during a during a, a heat wave but Klaus, you're there. Sangria is milking a buffalo. No, but milking a muffalo. Gotta read that right. You're heading over there. Okay. Um, Kathra did the beating up and got some as a result. Michael is making kibble. Okay, well, that's one way to get rid of the meat before it rots. Um, SP sleeping. Alicia digging at granite. Okay. And Sea Stars is as well. Before we started, Alicia was down here desperately needing a meal, and I, you know, I kind of went through them and gave them all quick orders before I hit record. And she wanted to walk all the way over here and all the way over there and all the way up there, and you know, this big long route to go get a meal. And I got to thinking, why can't we just get through the middle? And I got to looking, and we got a door system here now. We can punch this out. It's safe. So let's go ahead and I had her do both of them. I see she only did one, and she took out that wall. So Sea Star is going to finish it. Alicia, you're heading over into the prison area. Let's get you down and just work on on compacted steel. We need as much of this as we can get right now. And let's complete the. Uh, you're resting. Eric's going to bed. David is in bed. Grandma is butchering and not going to be up much longer. We're at 2000, so they're all going to bed here pretty quick. And Sea Star is just starting her day. All healed up. Mood's in good shape and I'm gonna work on that then how about you come down and also work with Alicia and get those done and we'll see how well that works oh I thought you were assigned do that one then come down and do that one and that and that one okay that works all right well that's everybody how are we doing up in here and boy I wish this rain would stop have I got we're over here we'll watch this go on. Have I got everybody off of hunting now? No. Sangria is still on hunting, but she is handling first. Let's take you off of hunting. No point in doing it in the rain and in the dark. It just doesn't work. And we have one opening here, which I'm guessing is necessary to make the orbital trade beacon work. I'm not certain, though. At least it is if we want them to drop things in. Otherwise, they'll drop things in, I guess, out over here and not under a roof. Let me know what you think about that. Can I close this up? It is 103 in here. Is there any reason to close it up though? Don't really need it, cool it or heat it. No, nah, not really. I guess it doesn't matter. Anyway, so they are doing that handy. Are you going to make it? Yeah, I think you're going to be fine for two more. You're almost done with this one. Yeah, you'll be fine. Uh, you don't need a meal right now. You just go straight to bed. So, speaking of straight to bed, let's see, Handy, Shantigo, Klaus, they're all kind of heading to bed right now. Sangria, before you go to bed, where am I at? There. No, your cleaning is all there, though you could clean up in here. Do that before you go to bed. And Michael doesn't clean, so there's no point in even asking him. <laughs> uh, Miss P is just getting up, and... Because of the heat issues in here, I got to thinking it would be wise to have more than one cooler in these bays over here. So I did a little bit of work over here. Um, had a punch hole, put an extra one right there so we can put a second cooler. Build a copy right there. She's punching into this one. And what I'm thinking of, we can vent these two rooms. They're both freezers. This one is a refrigerator. It'll have a different temperature, and this will be a refrigerator too. I, I'm assuming we may freeze it. I don't know, but you know, just that was the idea. So these two will be basically the same temperature. We could put a vent right there, and whatever, whichever one's in better shape, they can share 
temperature with the other one. I think that is the route I want to go with there. So temperature, vent, put you into there. So we're going to vent into this one. We have one cooler there for this one. We have now two coolers here for this one, which we'll share into that one. Between the three coolers, they should be able to handle this much space. This one over here, we have a cooler there that we pop another cooler right there, give us two of them. All of them into this chase right here, which vents out. That's the idea. Miss B is digging up marble. Do me a favor and pop this one, just so we can get that done and I can get that set. One of these days we'll get these built and we'll start using this, but no point in really doing much with that while this heat wave's going on. Um, you're not a constructor, clearly. Never mind. <laughs> Yeah, that was like pulling teeth. Um, down in here, I suppose so. Come on down here. Let's 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 see what's in this area. We haven't punched into this yet. There might be more steel in here. That'd be nice. All right. So Sea Stars made it down here. Alicia, where'd you go? Went to bed. Oh, it was nighttime for you. That's right. Forgot about that. Okay. Well, you got your two done. Then you quit. Is that the idea? You got one of them done. This one. You got most of the way done. And you said, uh-uh, no more. Okay, Sea Stars, how are you doing down here with the dark and with the uh, ugly environment? Only got a negative five out of it. Okay, and in darkness, negative three. We'll see how well you do as a miner. Michael wants to do mining too, but every time I send him in to do that, it uh, it drives him into a, uh, it drives his mood down too far. So I can't really let him do that unless it's already pre-lit or something. Kind of a come up with a way to make that work. Um, hmm. Just looking around. Who else is still up? David is out of sync, so he's just getting up for the night. He's supposed to be uh, supposed to be a day person, but that raid all through the night messed everybody up. We're, for the most part, up and going. Klaus needs... You're going to make it. You get these last two done, and, and we're finished. Good. So you're going to do that fine. What do we get David to do? David, come on up in here. Um, boy, was it last episode? It was last episode when we had all the, the stuff sitting in here. Yeah, I'm losing track now. Remember, I'm pre-recording a bunch of stuff. So this is, well, what is this, Friday for me. And I'm going to get two or three done and see how far that can go into the week that I'm gone next week. But I'm trying to remember what was talked about. Oh, that's a bad pause. Infestation. Oh, no. Boy, when I go to move and it doesn't move, that just, that worries me. Um, it will slowly spawn bugs as well as produce additional hives. If you don't want it to infest the whole area, muster your forces and destroy it. But beware, the bugs will defend their hives. Where? Okay. Well, this isn't too bad. We're sealed here, double walled, single walled here, and we just tore this down. <laughs> um, okay, we're in here. So really we need a quick backup wall right there. But we gotta do it without going into... Okay, let's... Uh, no, let's forbid that door. Let's forbid this door. What else do we have up in here? There's no more doors. Uh, well, there's no point in forbidding these because they can't get to them anyway. Alright, that one there. There's nobody in the area. Now, let me look everything else over. We didn't... It kind of hits randomly in various places. So we are in here. Okay, we've got to forbid that one. And that one. Okay, just working out beginnings of a strategy. We've got a bug infestation. Miss P is down here. And we all just went to bed, of course. All the rabbit and Cathra are going to be uh, well rested and ready to ready to go to battle. <laughs> uh, yeah, they both are. Okay. Uh, they're going to battle with some injuries, though, but that's just going to have to do because... Oh. Interesting. So Catherine's bite scar to the neck was not from Rabbit. That's just like a permanent five, 25 out of 30. It never heals the scar. I see how that works. Okay. Otherwise, Rabbit uh, 
took some injuries. So 23 of 25, 25 of 30, 28 of 30, 37 of 40. So five ticks to get the last of those done. But he can fight the way he is. Okay, Tomislav went to bed fairly early. He's halfway on his rest. Handy didn't. She's in trouble, so she's going to have to stay. Michael, uh, halfway. Chantigo, halfway. Autumn needing of food. I don't want to let this game run until I see what we're truly up against and what we can do about it. So we've got food in here, but no nest. Interesting. So we've got... Oh, the nest is right there. There it is. Okay. So they're one bite away into this room. Okay. Wish that door was done. What's left? Needs steel. Needs blocks. Needs everything. So we're going to... This is available to us. This is available to us. This is until they pick through. Okay. Um, we need to do something. We need to get the Insanity Lance down there where we can get to it easily. Natalia's out here using the telescope on a cloudy night. Oh well. <laughs> but this one is my bug insurance. I use that when they're picking away right here and they're going to bust into the house and, and, and get us. I'll use it on it. The others around him will attack it when it goes berserk and tries to attack them and it'll buy me time. So that's why I want that one. But it'd be nice to have that one down in here. And we need to start moving, think about moving boomalopes down here. And a boomalope going boom in here won't do any good. This one's sealed. We could boom a little... Nope, that won't do any good either. It only works in a sealed area. This isn't finished yet. Though the materials are there, and it used to be that the game would count that as a solid object. I don't know if it still does. We don't have enough done here to be sealed. And I don't want to burn this room out. There's too much to replace in here. I just... Unless, unless it can be done without completely destroying this stuff. Hmm... It's not that easy. Putting it out in a sealed room and it underground is different from putting out a fire in here where I can knock the walls out and it'll vent the heat. A little harder to get in and fight the fire afterward. Hmm. Challenges. This one, well, this one shouldn't be so bad if there wasn't something in the hallway. I could have somebody right here, somebody right there. They'd peek in, shoot. All the bugs move this way, close it. Peek in, shoot. All the bugs move this way, close it, peek and shoot. But I can't do that with bugs in here. We have no... Sea Stars is in there. Okay. <laughs> I just saw her. She's got to get through here, through there, through there, out this door, and into here immediately. Draft you get you to here, get you to here, and get you to here. Alright, that's your plan. Miss Pete, you're safe right now. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to take my time with this and think things through. This isn't going to be a raced through event. For starters, it's in the dark, and it's making it a lot harder. It's kind of like that other that raid up there. I wish these things happen in, in uh, a little more daylight. It's this dark in here. We don't, have a, we don't have a lot of lights in this area. Okay, well, boomalopes, I don't think are going to do us any good. We're sealed here. We're maybe sealed there. I don't know. Well, yeah, I just don't see it working. There's not enough stuff to burn. We're going to raise the temperature a bit, but not much. This one, I think, is going to be a shootout. And hopefully just one pathway at a time. I think that's it, but I think right off the bat we've got to, uh, to seal this up. So let's get going on that. So structure. Mm. Yeah, they're just going to have to make the pathway down here to get their supplies and go back. That is sealed right there. And they can't get through any other ways. They have to go this way. They have to go through here, through that opening, 
in there to get their supplies and go back. And that is until they bust through this one. So I guess we need to get that started. Okay, well, <clears throat> let's wall there, here. Let the, the wood stay in there just in case that helps to burn things out, if that becomes a thing. In fact, we could do something specifically about that. We could, well, let's get the door in. Um, boy, I hate using non-auto doors for this. We, need to, we may need to be able to escape quickly. That's going to be tough. But, well, we have components right there. What's an auto door take? It takes steel components. And the steel is kind of, you know, down there where we can't easily get to it. There is some steel over here. Miss a P, how about you immediately get over here and start making more steel? That's going to be your first task right there. So you start in that area, and that's where you're going. Now, yeah, we're going to make an auto door there. So right there, power is close enough. It will work. Okay. I need somebody to get on that immediately. Klaus, did you make it to bed? hate to do it to you because, yeah. You're heading for there. Um, David, you're up. You're a good constructor. Where are you at? Are you still meditating? You are talking to Purple. Well, that's going to have to uh, to be uh, put aside for now. David, work on this immediately. So, heading for steel right over there. Okay, that'd be enough to get that going. Now, I'm going to need a guard out here really quick. Who? Um, you're melee. You don't even have anything on you. So when you get to there, I need you to swing over and grab, what was the, the good one? Not the mace, it was this one, the Iqua. Let's go with that. Sea Stars, you're going to grab an Iqua. And after that, I will try to um, undraft you and figure out what to do with you. Okay, um, boy, which one of these sleepy, ready-to-break people do I start with? Grandma, you don't have any... Well, you do. You can shoot a little bit. You've got melee skills. Melee's not going to do a lot of good here, even with um, with the uh, the shield belts. They're just going to bite right through it. It only stops ranged attacks. So it really comes down to, to shooting. And needs... Let's let you sleep. David, Eric, Alicia... Hmm... Rabbit, where are you? You're where we're starting. Okay. So, Rabbit, I need a guard. Draft food is fine for now. So, I need you where? I need you probably right here, which means you're going through there. Okay. So, you're going to guard. We even know what the enemies are yet. And we don't know that they're going to pop into this room. If it pops within three or four spaces around randomly, it could pop right out there. So I don't really know what's up. Um, same thing here. This guy could pop in here and see starts in trouble. So yeah, I may I may have her mine across and go out that way. I don't know. <laughs> okay. So Kathra, you're available as well. So you needs your find your revolver draft. So rabbits go in there and. Kathra, I'm posting you. Hmm. Posting you right there. Who else can construct? Eric, I'm just going to grab you. Boy, you need food bad. You do. You have one on you? Um, gear? You do not. Okay, Eric, even though you're not going to be good for much longer, you're right there. Go grab a meal, eat the meal, and then come over and build this door. I need, I need a backup. So build me that door. Okay, with that going on there, what else? Natalia, you're a six at shooting now. You've got a revolver. You need food. Let's get that going right now. So hop in here, consume a meal, and then don't know where to send you yet. So we'll just kind of get everybody that's capable ready. So Thomas Saab, go grab a meal. And Handy, you sleep. Rabbit is already assigned. Shantigo, go grab a meal. Klaus, 
you're just going to have to go to bed, unfortunately. Uh, building a steel dining chair. No, go to bed. And Cathra, Natalia, Michael. You're there, you're there. Mood is there. You've got the assault rifle. I'm going to let you sleep a little bit longer. You're up in... You're out over here somewhere. You're right there. A little bit longer. You may be in the, the initial attack. So, Miss P is cute at digging steel. Eric, you are going to get that door built and probably go right back to bed. But we'll see how that works. Uh, meal first, though. And David, you are working on that. Grandma is going to sleep some more. And C-Stars is where we're starting. So, have to get her out of there. And we have to see what comes up. Any second now, they're all going to pop. Okay. Is that the only pop? I think so. So we've got... Zoom out a little bit. They're in here too. Don't see any in the hallways. Okay. We've got two of these mega spiders. We've got... And their run speed... Click on one of them. Is a 4.5. They're quite fast. Um, little guys... Right there, you are the spielipede. Spiel, yeah, spielipedes. We've got one, two of you. This isn't that bad. Okay, and a spielipede <clears throat> runs at 4.3, and the really tiny ones. None? Anything underneath that one? Marble chunk. Okay. Do we get off that easy? Well, I was expecting four or five out of each nest. Now there's four nests. Four nests. I feel like there's something I'm not seeing. There. Are they still coming out? They might be. We've got four mega scarabs. Oh, you're a mega spider, I see. So mega scarab is a 4.7. Wow, okay. So, same count, two, two, three now. They're still popping. They're still popping. Okay. Sea Stars made it to here. Alright, now what's the count? Big guys. Uh, do it this way. Big guys. There you are. Hard to see in the dark. We have four of those now. And the tiniest ones are right there. We have five of those now, and the medium ones, right there. Three of those. And they're already picking away at the walls. Yeah, this is going to get exciting. Do we bring a boom loop down? Will it do any good? The heat wave said, either get into a cool place or get into the mountain. So the mountain is not going to react too quickly to heat, I am guessing. It's going to absorb some of it, just like it's absorbing what's outside. Hmm, just debating things. If we get them to here, it's not going to contain. We're going to heat up. It's going to heat up all this space, all of this space, um, through this opening, through that opening, all of these cells. We're not going to be able to build any heat out of here. In here, we're open up to there as well. So this is the only one that we could burn out, and it's got the equipment we don't want to burn. So that's just not going to work. Okay. Um, once everyone gets meals, well, we need to get this construction going. But I would say as soon as possible, go ahead and just pick one room and start shooting everything in it. Then that'll cut our numbers down. And then we'll pick this entrance right here and take out just this one guy. Something like that, or just these two. And then we'll open up another door and let them loose and then be shooting down the hallways. Yeah, okay. What am I, 30 minutes into this already? Okay. Okay, so Rabbit's getting into place. He's just going to guard. And Thomas Slab are grabbing a meal. Where did David end up? He is hauling steel. Where did you go for steel? I wonder if you went up there for steel or something. No, you were going into there. We've run that little of the game so far. That's what's up. See, stars are already here. Okay, so you're going to make that run. We're already tapping away where? Right there, you're already trying to bust into here. I don't want to waste all oh, the lance. I was going to move the lance over to where it's it's more convenient to grab it. Let's just do that real quick. Give me um, zone, stockpile, and where? 
we're probably going to be in this area almost guaranteed so let's put it right there you are going to be clear all priority critical and boy manufactured no how about items <clears throat> this one's always hard to find not there art AI persona core not under weapons I don't think it would be it would be arranged if it was um, psychic what's that thing called psychic insanity lance right there too bad you can't find out right here where it's listed you know list you know, in the description listed under this such and such category all right let's just keep going till we figure it out because I want it brought over here um, by somebody who probably isn't good at uh, melee or at, at ranged it would be a good project for them to do so where are you so we're looking for the word psychic so it's not under weapons um, weapons apparel chunks corpses not down there let's go to artifacts bingo insanity lance that goes there so who would be the best person to get that in place I don't think I'm gonna use it just yet we're unless I start tapping through here if they're only tapping into this we still have another wall between us if they tap into here we're, before this is built then we're gonna to have to do something so who could do that Tomislav, Handy, Rabbit, Shantigo, Klaus. Uh, Shantigo has a sniper now. That's going to have to be changed out. So, Shantigo, where are you at? You are still getting your meal. So, get the meal and then head up and grab a pistol in here. Maybe, if it wasn't so dark. Yes, then grab this one. And then, while you're at it, I guess you're, you're the perfect person, then you can... Actually, I have to do it this way. Uh, hopefully, it'll let me haul. It'll only let me activate. Let's run the game for a little while. About there. Only activate. Come on. Really? Psychic Insanity Lance. This stockpile is set to normal. Um, there, the stockpile is set to critical, psychic insanity lance, and there's nothing here that I am, I don't know what to do with that. Okay, well, can randomly somebody else do it? Is it a Shantigo problem? Klaus, can you, you can only activate. I don't want to set somebody out here the entire time getting ready to activate it. That's no fair. Uh, go here. Oh, because you're drafted. Natalia doesn't haul, so no point even trying. Rabbit does. He's 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 drafted. Handy can only activate. Hmm. Okay, so we have a problem there. Anyway, Sea Stars is out. That was important. Okay, you're tapping away over here. You may give up. Or may not. So you're basic. This group is basically into this room. Okay, we're sealed there. We're sealed there. We're sealed there. And yeah, I think it'd be wise. See, stars, where you're going? Right there. We're gonna seal here and here. Any reason to seal down below? If just to keep them from going there. There's no. Yeah, they can keep cutting through these directions. Okay, so this one we're going to seal as well. Okay, well that controls who's going to, without uh, um, without me realizing it, run down there to go pick up something and uh, get overwhelmed and eaten. Okay, so next. It's just... Okay, I'm pausing so much to try to save as much time as possible because things like this are going to happen very quickly but it also at the same time feels like nothing's getting done so it's you know both sides of the coin there so you guys are in here anybody eating nobody tapping through so they're going to go through these walls really quick that's something to think about with these infestations David is doing what Can we, can we just do this? <laughs> Components. And they always do everything but the one you want. And they save it for last. 
Mm. What if I did this? David, um, clear and do that. Okay, now just clear. Now let's work on this. Good. So we'll just do that. That noise. It was a bug noise, but it was a, a warning that they're about to start tapping through another wall. What are you doing? Ah, got a tap over here. Okay, well you tap at that one all you want. That's already already broken through. Okay. So you guys over here, Eric is building this one. Eric is smoothing a floor. Eric, don't be smoothing a floor. Kathra, go here. Eric, that door work? He can't work on it because Kathra's standing in it. Okay, so build that one. <laughs> okay, yep. And Rabbit, I think I want you right here. Let's just take you to that side. Kathra, tapping through there. Let's cancel this uh, deconstruct order just in case somebody for some really weird reason decides to, to fulfill it. Eric, you're continuing to do that. And David, you're continuing to haul granite blocks. So you've got to go all the way around to here to get those. You're, you're going after those granite blocks. <laughs> OK, let's redo your orders. We're going to not forbid this one. We're going to tell you all over again to work on this door. And now you're going for those granite blocks. Okay, we're going to have to babysit every step of this if we're going to get it done in time. You're going to grab those. Eric is working on this door. Good, grab those. Go back. The Insanity Lance, wonder where it's at. Okay, you're going that way, you're going down. You don't need to do this wall too. No, I'm sorry, but can we... Now, let's... Okay. David, cancel. Work on this one. Okay, grab that. Go through there. We're not tapping on walls here yet. And... Okay, well, is it enough? It's enough. Okay. Um, Rabbit does not have a good construction skill. So if I have him do this one, he may, uh, he may fail at it. So I'm not going to do that. Okay, you guys are still not working on a wall here. You did get through this one. Okay. So where are you guys going next? You're probably going down into here. Yep, you're going through that one next. And that's fine. Okay. I knew these infestations, at least early on when we don't have the turrets in place, are going to be quite the challenge. So this is definitely going to be a two episode uh, experience here. I'm going to take my time and just work through this meticulously um, and I'm tired I just, just finished a day's work so I'm not not keeping my train of thought as well as I would like tapping away working on that one working on this one Eric where are you at now let me guess you went to bed right um, there you are you are hauling granite blocks to I wish I could see your pathway right through there to there and that's all we need left just five more blocks okay and that's done. So you'll be getting to that one. Everybody else should be... In fact, where is everybody else? I kind of got you going and then forgot about you. So Rabbit's there. Shantigo is going back to bed, but you got food in you. All right. I'd say that's fine. We can pull you right out of there. You got your pistol, but you couldn't get the Insanity Lance because it wouldn't let you. Out of curiosity, is it possible now to do it? Now I, now I can haul it. Okay, Sangria, your turn. Let's haul this right there haul and then come over and grab a meal and you'll be ready for whatever's coming up okay um, that's rabbit Klaus is resting and needs you'll be ready to grab a meal when this all gets going Kathra has given up and she's meditating which is probably okay rabbit do I let you go off and do something else you're actually in really good shape though you're heading for there because of insulted, uh huh, ugly environment, disturbed sleep, t feeling terrible, and a moderate amount of pain. You're still healing, okay. Um, if I sent you to do this, actually, no. Let's send you to gra go grab a meal. Let's go that route. 
you'll be ready for whatever comes up next and you'll be in a much nicer place so your beauty will go up david just gonna hmm though it'd be nice to have a gun ready in case something happens well i'll wait until something happens this will take some a while to tick through yeah here and there everybody's behaving if they go into here we're in trouble this is where the insanity lance needs to be in place Okay, door going in, door going in, you are wandering, you are wandering, no more tapping going on over here, we're fine, it must be daytime, four in the morning, even inside the mountain it starts to get lighter, interesting how that works, so it starts feeling better out here, but it isn't so black in here anymore, okay, still lots of welding going on. All right, I saw that one move and freaked me out there. Anything else to have anybody else doing? Sea stars consuming a meal. I probably left you uh, um, drafted, didn't I? Okay, Miss P, you're down here tapping away, and I'm very thankful for that. So, right there. And just in case I don't get back to you, we'll do those and those. Okay, that's over there. What else is going on? Kethra attempting to recruit purple. I wish I could just make you go to sleep or something. No, let's make you get a meal. I want you guys as prepared as possible for what's going to happen. Um, Eric, you're just finishing up. David, still working on these guys. Okay, besides you two, Miss B, Natalia, where are you at right now? You're making that assault rifle. Good, we could sure use that. Sangria's grabbing a meal. Um, sleeping, sleeping. That is it. Okay, waiting for these doors to go in. Where am I? Right there. And checking for anybody else. Where else could these guys be tapping through? They could work their way up really nowhere. That's the only wall right there that's that's worrisome. That spot, and then this spot over here. Yeah, okay, we're okay. Once they start, we've got to react. What am I missing here? David went away. What'd you do? Consume a meal. Grab that after you finish this. It doesn't take you long to do that. Then you can grab a meal. Um, I got it right, right? Yeah, you're coming back down. Okay, Eric's going to have to go to bed soon. He was already... Well, actually, he's not as bad as I thought. Okay, he's good for a while. All right, anybody? Any monsters tapping where they're not supposed to? A lot of activity right here. And they go quick when they start running. No, they're behaving. Come on, guys. All right, that's sealed. So we have a backup plan there. This will be sealed from the hospital. We're sealed there. We're sealed here. Okay, so we have backup plans here. Though they're going to have access to all of this if they come through. Okay. So that has held them off long enough for the majority of us to get some more sleep and get ready for today's battle. Eric is done and you're smoothing. I have noticed that whenever I give them an order over a tile that has a smoothing underneath, it automatically adds that to the list, even though I didn't click it. So clear that. You are building a standing lamp. Sure, if it's right there, let's get some light in here. And you are just on building mode. Okay, what to do with an Eric for this purpose here? Um... Punch those, or get these built. You've got five. Marble block, one more. 25 of 25 door and f vent five of 30. We're not going to get that done. We're sealed there. We're sealed there. We're sealed. All of these are sealed right there. And I don't dare risk you in here. Though we could get these doors closed. That might be wise. Okay, so Eric, let's make a run. Now, they shouldn't tap through before you could get there and back again. Okay, so Eric, you draft. You're going to run to here, then you're going to there. And then you're going back, and you're going to there. Um, I don't know which pathway you're going to take on that one.
because that is not sealed. Forbid. Okay. Didn't think I was going to need to forbid that, but now I do. Okay, any tapping in here? We're good there. And you, what you doing? You're wandering. Okay. So Eric made his run. And you're going that way. That's safe. That's fine. And you're going that way. Okay. David is in here. He's working on walls. So this is where I'm going to have to, to really keep an eye on them. All right. So it's about time we go ahead and start an attack then. Not much more we can do to prepare for it. So Eric, un... David, draft. Undraft. Undraft. So... What is the plan, and do we do it this time? Actually, I'm looking at 45 minutes. I think we'll call this one the setup, and next time we'll execute the, the attack. So, grand total now, final total. Mega spiders, four. Mega scarabs? What are the little ones called? There, mega scarabs. Five, and the middle guys are called spielipedes. Three. That's what we're up against. So I'm going to call this one done, stare at this a little bit, and come up with my game plan, and then start recording again. So this has been Noble Rambler. I'll catch you guys later. Bye-bye.